You want to make a poll natively on Twitch? That is possible, let me show you how. You go to twitch.tv, here in the top right you click on your own avatar and then go to creator dashboard. Then here in the bottom right you see quick actions. It can be somewhere else as you can move this platform to wherever you want. So, <laughs> And now here you see manage pool. If you don't see it, click on the plus and here you have manage your stream, grow your community. Manage your chat and here on the grow your community it says manage poll and you click on edit here. It will look like this, but now it says edit. We click on manage poll. Polls are a great way to interact with your viewers, ask them questions and react to their feedback. Create a new poll. Okay, here we can put a question. So pineapple on pizza. And then yes, no, indifferent, what's pizza? I guess we could make one with what's pineapple too. <laughs> and then now, if you start a poll, people can vote on one of these four options. You can have a maximum of five options and a minimum of two. Like it says up here, you need to fill in at least two because they need to have a choice in a poll. They can normally just vote on one. But here, allow additional votes. If we click on this, they can also do an extra vote for every 10 bits. So they can pay 10 bits to vote another time. Basically, if they would put in 1000 bits, they can vote 100 votes. You can make this higher if you want. You can also set that for channel points. So now they pay 200 channel points and they can put in an extra vote. If you don't want any of this, untick this and it will not work. Everybody can just vote once. If you want one of the two, tick this and then untick the one that you don't want to use. So if you only want to use channel points, do it like this for only bits like this. We can also hire this up to, for example, 5,000 bits. Now, somebody who donates 5,000 bits, now somebody that donates 5,000 bits can vote a second time or even a turn if they donate another 5,000 bits. Then here it says duration. This is how long the poll will be active. How long can people vote for? You can set it on one minute, two minutes, three minutes, five minutes, or 10 minutes. I definitely recommend putting it in longer than a minute because a minute is kind of short. So let's say we do two minutes. If we start the poll, you see here in our created dashboard that it has started. It says pineapple and pizza, few results and poll, delete poll. So we can instantly end it if we were like, oh, it takes too long. I set out 10 minutes, but we already, we already know who's gonna win. We can end it. We can also view the results. This is the ongoing poll right now. This is the browser source URL of the poll, which we can use. We can also do a vote breakdown here. We can see more about it as well. And we can instantly end the poll here as well. If we would go to our own channel now and go to chat, we will see that the poll is active here. This is what viewers see and they can vote. Yes, no, indifferent votes. Now indifferent has a vote. What we can also do is add a browser source here in OBS. And here we put this in 1080, 1920. And then we will see the poll in here. We need to accept the cookies. We can do that by interacting with it, accept the cookies. So now we have the poll here as well. So you can have the poll in your OBS like that. And now next time we post the poll, it will be in here as well. It will keep being in the OBS. Now, if we go back here, we see that it ended an indifferent one because that's what I voted on. We can view the results again by clicking on here. We go back to the same page. And then if we want to make a new one, we just click on manage poll and we can make a new poll by clicking on new poll. If you make this new poll, it will get the same URL pop out tree poll, which means that every new poll will be coming into the same browser source on your OBS and you do not have to change this. Another cool feature Twitch just added to Twitch is shared bands. I explain everything and how you can set it up yourself in this video. I recommend jumping in here and setting it up so you and your best streamer friends have the same band list. I'll see you there.